good morning students we can say today we will do a part 3 okay of chapter number 1 as we just look up the name of the this is interesting that means to understand it's a chapter 1 the name is cycle of europeans in india and standard 8 subject social science okay now british interested in naturally when we are just looking out okay, when other people are roaming we can say for doing the business okay in our country in our country what will happen the other european people will also be angered okay they want to do the business and on that they will go to british uh, the british is the most powerful we can say okay on that time and uh, today also we know the britain the british have the only the one queen and uh, they doesn't have the democracy like us after independence we have the democracy country we have the right to vote but they doesn't have okay you will not for the talk about the voting system it's a different but i'm just literally telling okay queen was there on that end uh raja or rani whatever the union doesn't have the matter okay so when the british got interest in india on that time there was a queen ruling in on england it was named as anjan okay in the year 1600 in the year 16 Hundred. It means we can say the European people are entered by the form of the Portuguese, by the form of the who, by the form of the Portuguese, by the form of the we can say uh, Dutch, hella. So when it's from the 14th century they entered. Well, actually we are talking about British rule who over ruled over us or our country for more than 200 years or 200 whatever you want to tell because the first of they have started for the trade and the business and afterward. And afterwards, they started ruling over us, and that's why we can say it was the law of the country to rule over our nation. Okay, so let's start with the region. How they started? How they entered on that? We know the fact that British other European countries were entering on that time. The British established the East India Company. First, they were called as the East India Company. This company belonged to the merchants, the businessmen who were being towards to do the business. Increase their wealth by undertaking trade with India by doing the business with the India because on that time we know the value of the commodity is very few things were very much dependent not only the crops uh, spices were also very dependent value of the things idols such value of the things of the Indian culture they are much fond of and they want the things to their own country so that they want to do the business with them and have the collect more and more wealth understood and mostly. Refer to the English mode so that you can understand. Now you are in the eighth standard. If you talk about कि मैं हमें समझ में नहीं आता मैं हिंदी में भी बोल रही हूँ लेकिन आप अपने को तो English mode so that you understand because now you came to the eighth standard, the ninth and tenth and upper section and other part. English में भी पढ़ते हैं इंग्लिश में पढ़ते हैं इंग्लिश समझ में नहीं आता है ना ऐसा होता है वेस्ट टाइम वी नो सम ऑफ़ दिस दिस टाइप ऑफ़ thinking are there of peoples nearby ठीक है so I will just explain in English only, but some of Hindi also follow me. Like that, I will talk about English only. Okay? So that you can understand the sentence also of the text. Otherwise, you will learn. Okay, understood. Actually, there is a question. Okay. As this company belonged to the merchants who wanted to increase their wealth by undertaking the trade with India, the first British ship. You know, the very time happened. This is the one question when asked in the Karunpati. We know that Amitabh Bachchan from one million years Karunpati are there. So we know the the question who was just comes from the highest from the history of the most highest rate. The who matter who did the most number of lakh, two hundred fifty lakh, five hundred lakh. The question so they come from the we came from the question. We have one question was there from here only. I was just remain many but Karunpati. They did on that time we can say. के सबसे हाईएस्ट पांच का क्वेश्चन था वो यही क्वेश्चन में से था कि हु वाज द फर्स्ट ब्रिटिश हु वाज द फर्स्ट ब्रिटिश हु केम टू आवर कंट्री अंडरस्टूड ओके यू अंडरस्टैंड बेटा व्हाट इज हियर ओके अंडरस्टूड वी हैव वी आर टॉकिंग अबाउट द हु अबाउट द ब्रिटिश राइट और प्रीवियसली आल्सो टोल्ड कि व्हाट आर द क्वेश्चंस आर देयर ओके दे आर आस्किंग फ्रॉम द पूछे जाते हैं, ठीक है? Because history is very important for us for 
knowing the things, okay? We know nowadays we are wearing a mask, it's very compulsory, okay? Sometimes I'm wearing, but uh, in video I'm alone, so it's okay. I'm just telling to you, I'm going to go away after the group, shall that, okay? Sometimes it happens, it's closing also, so don't worry about it, you know, it's again to the state out also, okay? So who was the first British? British, you can say, he was the captain W. Hawkins. Uh, we can say the captain of the ship, the first person, the first person who sat food in India in which year we can say 1600 AC. Understood? He met Jahangir but did not get his permission to trade. Okay? He actually what was the one that can put with the ruling. He met the king for getting the permission for he doesn't get the permission on that turn for the trade. Then after, second we can say the uh, Governor General, whoever the person of the British was there, Sir Thomas Root, who actually, okay, who arrived in India, who acquired the permission. We know that permission is even where to acquire the permission to establish trading in Surat, not in Bengal. Okay? What is written? Surat me, if Surat me bar karte hai, to who had given the permission? After the first captain, Dr. Hawkins came to the first person. To do the business, okay. <coughs> but Sir Thomas who arrived in India and get the permission to establish a trading center in Surat. Okay? Then after the second time he got the permission, here the king's name is not given. That's why someone was telling Sahaja and someone was telling Jahangir. Because Sahaja at that time was ruling over the dam. That's why. Okay? Now, later we know Delhi.
rules by uh, the countries by people. That's why whoever rule, uh, whoever rule on that part, they will fight it. And the French at last lived, and on that time, the British, Britishers, we can say the actual Britishers, the Britishers, they continue to rule on the part of the India, the whole India by capturing different rules and regulations, the alliances were there. Okay. Yeah. Without paying tax against or any 